Hi, I'm Brandy. Welcome to Tinseltown. Let me show you around. Um, first and foremost, most important thing you need to know about Tinseltown, we like to have fun here. This is our patient of the day board, but we also utilize this to make some seasonal jokes. So we do have some Christmas themed jokes up right now. And if you want to follow me this way, we can go see our cat friends. The biggest learning experience you've had as a practice manager? Um, definitely my biggest learning experience I've had as a practice manager was when I moved from the Nocatee location over to the Tinseltown location. If you've ever been to either of those two hospitals, you know how different it is. So I would say coming to Tinseltown would be my biggest learning experience. What made you want to work in this field? Um, I've always really loved animals. Even as a kid, I grew up with horses, dogs, and I always tried to bring animals home. But the thing that really made me want to work in this field is my childhood dog. Her name was Jillian. Um, she was a dachshund and she had a lot of medical problems and one of my main responsibilities growing up was to care for her and give her her medications. So that just had, that made me find like a really big passion in the veterinary field. I think we should grab a friend really quick. Come on, chickadee. Come here, baby. And Brandy, what was one thing people be most surprised to know about you? Oh, that's a really good question. Um, I used to live in South Korea, so I do speak like three words in Korean. I've forgotten a lot of it though. Do you have any pets? I do. We have so many animals at home. Um, I have a nine-year-old mixed breed, like largest dog named Ginger. We also have a three-year-old mixed breed dog named Olive. Today's actually her birthday. Um, I also have two cats. One is named Sewer Cat. He's probably about seven. You can probably guess where he came from based on his name. And then uh, the baby of the house is Karma. She's about six months old. Brandy, do you have a favorite artist? Oh my gosh, yes. Anybody who knows me knows that I love Taylor Swift. Actually, come see my office real quick. I wouldn't be able to get any work done if I didn't have my Taylor Swift calendar or my Taylor Swift magnets or my Taylor Swift water bottle or my sweatshirt. Okay, and along with loving Taylor Swift, what is your favorite hobby? I really love to read. I've actually read about 65 books this year so far. And what types of animals come into this location in particular? Well, we'll see a lot of different types of animals, especially with Dr. Linda. Of course, we see cats and dogs, but we also see exotics here. Look at the jacket! Oh my gosh! Thank you. All right. So, Brandy, what are you currently watching right now? Um, I'm currently in the middle of a massive Criminal Minds rewatch. And do you have a favorite TV show? Definitely. Friends has always been my favorite show. I've probably watched it at least 12 times all the way through. And favorite character? Does it have to be from the show? I think I relate to Monica Geller on a very deep personal level. What is your favorite piece of childhood nostalgia? Um, as a kid, I loved playing Nintendogs. Like my DS was probably the favorite thing that I owned. And what is one of your first memories as a practice manager? Uh, the first time I did an interview, I think I was more nervous than the person I was interviewing. It was a huge learning experience for me to say the least. How do you like to unwind from stress after a busy day at work? Well, days at Tinseltown definitely get pretty hectic. Um, I would say my favorite way is definitely spending time with all of my animals and my husband. Um, love a good bubble bath and maybe a glass of wine if it was a really crazy day. What is your favorite aspect of our workplace culture? Um, I really love the opportunities for growth within Forever Vets. I came to Forever Vets with very limited veterinary experience and the amount of things that I have been taught has been just so incredible. I never thought I would have the opportunities that I've been given here. Hey, what is your favorite breed? Um, really big Rottweiler lover. I grew up with Rottweilers when I was a kid, so I always love seeing them whenever they come in. Have a piece of advice for pet owners. What is that? Prevention is cheaper than treatment. Brandy, do you have a favorite memory while working in the field? 
Um, yes. The first time I ever got to scrub in on a surgery, I felt so important and I really felt like I had made a physical difference in that pet's life. So it was very rewarding. And if you could only use one emoji for the rest of your life, what would that be? That's a really good question. For me, it'd have to be the face palm because that's me like at least 12 times a day. Something you've always wanted to do but haven't done yet? Um, I would definitely have to say meet Taylor Swift. Taylor, if you're watching this, I'm available anytime. I will go into any amount of credit card debt for you. <laughs> what inspired you most? Um, getting to work with Dr. G, seeing his work ethic in the way that he cares for his patients, his team, the other doctors here, just on a personal level. I've never gotten to work with somebody quite like him. Um, so seeing him really inspires me to be my best self. Amazing. And before we go, is there anything else that you want to show us? Um, oh, no. Absolutely. Something that you need to know about Tinseltown before you leave is that uh, we're the goats. And what is this from? So we won the Forever Vets Olympics this year. We are the champions 2023. Don't you forget it. Well, thank you guys for coming. We uh, look forward to seeing you next time at Tinseltown.